Well, once again, we're very honored to be selected by our peers as the uh, preseason favorite in the indoor track and field championships this year. Um, that's basically been a tradition that we started several years ago, and you know we're we're looking at another successful season. Although we have graduated, you know, 12 outstanding seniors, but uh, the young guys on our program right now they understand the tradition that previous seniors have developed into our program. Uh, we've got. 75 to 80 young guys out for track and field right now, and they've accepted that challenge. And so uh, we're looking forward to a great season. And you've had one meet already, or really two meets. What did you see so far that keeps you optimistic for the year? Well, I, I think it's a little different team this year, Kevin. We've, you know, like I mentioned, graduated 12 outstanding seniors last year, and several of those were national caliber type of athletes. This year we, we appear to have more depth in a lot of the events. Um, you know, we've already got five pole vaulters qualified for the conference out of the first weekend. We've got a, a great bunch of young throwers uh, led by Andy Hunkler, a senior who uh, you know, had our third best throw in school history Friday night in the weight throw. Uh, our core of distance runners have all returned from last year, and we knew that was going to be a strong group for us. Um, but you know, from top to bottom, I think the, the best word to describe our team this year, Kevin, would be depth. Uh, maybe lacking on those national caliber type of athletes, so to speak, that we've had in the past. But, uh, you know, just a pretty good, well-rounded uh, team of men this year that we're very excited about.